There are some people in this world who somehow manage to baffle the mind and send us all into deep thought as to how they can simply exist in the same world and yet be so incredibly bizarre. Some people in the world with hidden talents or unusual skills that makes you think that superheroes really do exist in the world. Some people are born naturally gifted and they have the amazing ability to do things we could never dream of doing. Here are top 10 most unusual and bizarre people around the world unbelievable peoples. Before we begin, make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notified every day for more amazing content. Nomi Elizabeth Romero who woman. A 24-year-old woman dubbed the backquote Peruvian Rapunzel is hoping to claim the world record for the longest hair, with shining tresses currently measuring an astonishing 5.8 feet, 1.7 meters, in length. The current record stands at 4.99 feet, but Nomi Elizabeth Romero who woman is confident her impressively long hair can see her crown the new title holder with the Guinness Book of World Records. The woman said long hair runs in her family. She said her secret to keeping her hair soft, straight and beautiful is to braid every day. I never have it loose. I wash every 3 days with any type of shampoo and sometimes use conditioner. Sometimes it weighs me down and they tell me that it removes proteins and that's why I'm skinny, but I know it's not like that. Lance Wooten Lance Wooten, a 32-year-old id supervisor from Kentucky, has has made a worldwide name for himself thanks to his incredibly luscious waist long beard. Wooten started growing his facial hair in June of 2014 to complement a pirate costume he planned on wearing for Halloween. By the time October came around, he had already grown an impressive looking beard, which happened to draw the attention of a friend who owned a local barber shop and invited him to check out some beard care products. He didn't even know such things existed, but he bought some, used them on his beard, and posted photos of the results on social media. That's how he got invited to his first beard competition, where he was introduced to a tight community of passionate beard growers. He was instantly hooked and decided to keep growing his beard, even though everyone around him told him to shave it off. Today, his luscious facial hair measures 2.5 feet and reaches down to his waist. Still, he doesn't plan on shaving his beard anytime soon. It has gotten him worldwide attention, sponsors and given him an opportunity to travel the world, so he feels like the pros definitely outweigh the cons. F Back in a beaver. A fitness model, addicted to bodybuilding, has been nicknamed Miss Iron Bum by her fans as a result of her incredibly fit physique. Bakhane Beaver, from Dnipro City, Ukraine, was bullied as a teenager because of her naturally thin frame and skinny legs. The 25-year-old decided to change her body and stuck to a strict fitness regime when she was 17. The Ukrainian woman, unlike other fitness models, admits taking steroids, but says she won't recommend others to use any performance-enhancing drugs in order to increase their muscle mass and strength. Fitness model Bakhane Beaver is instantly recognizable because of her thighs, ripped torso and dark black pupils. But as admirable as this sentiment may be, it's back has alternative take on fitness photos and workout videos that have brought her the most attention and an army of fans. The gym bunny, who is originally from Azerbaijan, has chosen to post pictures and films all shot from behind. Baka, who lives in Dnipropetrovsk in the western Ukraine's Dnipropetrovsk Oblast, says she hasn't always had this physique. When she was growing up other children made fun of her naturally thin frame, and in particular her skinny legs. Baka made it her mission to regularly work out, and hasn't looked back since. 12 million views. Interestingly, this isn't Duo's first fake human flesh prod, Dakota Cook. Dakota Cook, otherwise known on Instagram as Dakota the Bearded Lady, is a 27-year-old performer living in Los Angeles. She has a rare condition called hirsutism that causes hormonal imbalances and the excess growth of facial hair. Dakota never let it stand in her way and she embraced her beauty and unique look and has become a successful performer. After spending 10 years ashamed of her facial hair, she started growing it out 5 years ago. At first it was an experiment. Today, she credits her beard with helping her to become the happiest she's ever been. Dakota is passionate about helping the homeless community, often bringing care packages to folks on Hollywood. She carries spare tampons for homeless folks who need them. She is also an animal lover, and she does what she can to help whenever a new fire strikes in the area. 
Her beard also gained her entry into the world of sideshow, or throwback to the carnival days of so-called freaks and human oddities. In the future, she hopes to learn how to lie on a bed of nails, swallow a sword, and walk on a ladder of blades. Tisha Shelton a young woman born without arms, who made a series of YouTube videos demonstrating how she uses her feet to carry out a range of daily tasks, has told how she can't find the job. Tisha Shelton, 32 year old, from St. Louis, Missouri, decided to create a video blog this summer in a bid to show employers that her disability is not an obstacle. In the clips she is seen doing everything from eating with chopsticks to applying makeup. However the graphic design graduate, who has attracted more than 1.57 million hits worldwide, says that she is still unemployed and is finding it difficult to secure work in such a tough market, as well as creating the videos which show how she uses her feet to do a range of tasks. Tisha explains that she was born with no arms and instead she has little holes where her upper limbs should be. Her right leg is curved and also shorter than her left leg by about 8 inches with her heel turned outwards. Dissatisfied with shoe lifts, Tisha now has a specially designed prosthesis which was created to fit the shape of her right heel and foot. Tisha who is now looking to secure work as a graphic designer added, I live independently and I do everything by myself. Danny Sklieb Danny Sklieb, the creator of a unique art form called Topigamy, spent a whopping 200 hours making an awe-inspiring portrait of actor Bill Murray exclusively out of hundreds of rolled pieces of vinyl tape glued to a wooden panel. Sacramento-based artist Danny Sklieb has spent the last 14 years of his life refining the contemporary art of Topigamy, which looks very similar to quilling, only with vinyl masking tape instead of rolled bits of paper. He recently perfected his technique to a level that allows him to create portraiture, and his first project was an amazing portraits of Bill Murray made out of tiny strips of rolled tape. It's only when you get up close and see how he nailed all the subtle details, like the actor's beard and eyes, that you really start to appreciate all the work that went into the artwork. Talking to the San Francisco Chronicle a few years back, Danny Sklieb said that he was attracted to vinyl tape because it was the perfect material for an art form that anyone could get into. People are finding out it's really fun to work with as a way to create art. Mary A. Perkins A student has finally embraced her vitiligo after years spending hundreds of dollars a month on makeup to mask it. Up until a year ago, Mary A. Perkins, 21 year old, would hide the white patches on her face with thick makeup. The criminology student, from Timonium, Maryland, got so skilled at applying it that, if you didn't look at her white hands, it was impossible to tell she had vitiligo a skin condition that causes pale white patches to appear on the skin, caused by a lack of the pigment melanin. She would rely on heavy duty foundations, which she blended herself to get the perfect skin match, and setting powders. Mary A posted pictures showing her natural beauty on social media, and was amazed by the positive comments she received. She is now happy to not just go out in public barefaced, but when she performs as a dancer too. In Mary A's case, her vitiligo started as a tiny dot on her finger when she was in 7th grade. She started covering up the light patches on her face, fearing she would be bullied due to the condition. Wade McCree Washington and BJ Glaze Wade McCree Washington and BJ Glaze, both now 47, were diagnosed with the disorder at birth, but they have never stopped dreaming big. The married couple also live with scoliosis, a rare spinal disease, which adds to their difficulty to perform everyday tasks. It was more than 20 years ago, since Wade and BJ met at college in Houston, Texas, where they now live together, and they haven't looked back since. Quitting has never been an option in their world and that's largely down to their expert trainer, Tina Chandler, and motivator, Carl Ducina, two people who have played a pivotal role in their lives. Since his first training session with Tina, Wade has gone on to become a world champion in the adaptive bodybuilding division, an extraordinary achievement. Wade and BJ now help Tina and Cole with their back quote normal to be fit program, where they help to inspire others to get fit despite living with a disability. Wade and BJ now have high hopes to continue their volunteering assistance and become personal trainers. Before we begin, make sure you hit that subscribe button to get notified every day for more amazing content.
With this being said, let's begin.